I'm Jose Bilson, as you mentioned. I am an educator in Washington Heights, and I've been teaching at a public school now for the better part of eight years. Um, I also blog on the side, I do a little bit of writing, and I should have an upcoming book uh, next year, so I'm very excited about that. Uh, what's, can you tell us the name of your, of your blog and your book? The name of my blog is thejosebilson.com and there I write about education, race, and um, just the intersections of um, all these little pieces that end up making up my experience with uh, my students. And as far as uh, my book, it's called This Is Not a Test, a new narrative on race class and the future of education. It's a little long, but all you gotta remember is this is not a test. Uh, my mom is Dominican, my father is Haitian, and uh, I've been, I grew up on the Lower East Side for the better part of 30 years, and I've been spending the rest of my days in um, East Harlem and Barrio, uh, right in between um, El Museo de Barrio and the Schomburg. <laughs> I was born on January 24th, and um, that's also the day that Arturo Schomburg was born. Now, of course, um, I did not know that for a really long time, but once I started doing the digging, I found out a few things. Number one, when he started actually doing his work in Harlem, he wasn't recognized as, um, as a premier scholar. He was often you know, set to the side because he was Afro-Latino, but quietly he started assembling things, putting the work in, you know, trying to get that knowledge about what was going on in the African American community, and he started developing that groundswell to the point where he be, he did get recognition for becoming, um, for for being a scholar, a premier scholar of African, uh, I, I guess of, of African culture generally. Um, I I would advocate to those of us who think you know being Afro Latino is just you know yes you know, doing cultural pieces or just doing dancing or music or baseball or any sort of like recreational piece. That's all good. We need that. And but we also need people who are willing to do some of the work on the on the ground and being able to say, all right, let's expand all of it. Um